Hello everybody, Cameron here from Programming Basics. Um, in our last video, we talked about how to make a web view. Um, and today, we are gonna figure out how to load a web view without this little H, uh, HTTPS, but just using normal HTTP. Apple introduced uh, the app transport security. Um, they want everything in HTTPS. Um, some people debate on whether or not this is to make people feel safer or whether or not it really is safer. I believe in some instances it is safer to have HTTPS, but I think having it all the time could be unnecessary. I feel like not everything out there needs to be encrypted, but that's just me. Um, so I'm going to run this program uh, and we're going to load google.com. So I'm going to show you what happens right now when we try to load HTTP colon slash slash google.com and we're gonna get a nice little error most likely hopefully and nothing's there it is app transport security is blocked clear text HTTP we are gonna remove that we're gonna fix that so you don't have to worry about that so you're gonna actually um, just go to your uh, just click on your project and then go into uh, info um, and then under just somewhere uh, just add a new row um, and we're going to look for the app transport security settings um, so you're going to do that uh, then you're going to open up this little bullet down hit add allow arbitrary loads this is for the HTTP it's currently on no go ahead Put that to yes. You can even add um, exception domains um, and then you can open up that bullet and actually add exception domains as well but I'm not going to worry about that today. So now if I load up our little web view project, load it up as you can see no error has come up yet and Google is right here on the screen. So that is how to use uh, the app transport security in the most basic sense in order to load HTTP addresses. In the next video, we will address how to um, use it to load individual websites in HTTP and have everything else be encrypted, uh, which would be the exception. So we'll do that in the next video. But in the meantime, thank you so much for watching.